Hey howdy hey guys, welcome to another episode of Toy Story What If. Now this episode we're going to be focusing on what if Jessie wasn't abandoned? What if she was still with Emily? Will the events in Toy Story 2 be different? Stay tuned guys for this next episode. If you haven't subscribed already, uh, please press the subscribe button and press the bell icon to notify you for my next videos. Alright, back to the series. So, we return back at Toy Story 2. In that montage scene, When She Loved Me, Emily finds Jessie under her bed. A piece of her childhood opens up, being that little girl again, remembering all her precious memories her and Jessie had. And we're going to change something very big in this timeline because this is going to change a lot between Toy Story 2 for the whole plot, Toy Story 3 and 4. We're going to say Emily actually keeps Jessie because why would she give her away? That's her favourite doll. At least keep her at least for your kid. But anyway, in this timeline, Emily does that and she keeps Jessie. Sadly, Al will never complete his Woody's Roundup collection, so comment down below of Sad Face Al. Anyway, let's continue to the story. So, Emily sort of have Jessie around her house. She places Jessie on her shelf, and Jessie sort of sees Emily's day. In a sort of sad but beautiful way, Jessie sort of doesn't really feel sad. She is more happy that Emily finally noticed her, and Jessie can be part of Emily's life again, just like how she was a kid. A few years go by, in a sunny day. Emily comes back home, and she goes to her old bedroom. On the top of the shelf is Jessie, full of dust. She then picks up the doll and head downstairs. In the living room, there was a little girl. She sort of looked a bit like Emily. Emily then just placed the doll in this little girl's hand. The little girl turned out to be Emily's daughter. Her name was Jessica. Jessie now realised that she's got a new owner, a new story, and a new adventure. Now, this is very similar to Woody. How Andy's dad gave his doll to his son, Jessie will eventually become sort of the lead of the group, as Jessica will probably have more toys, and I guess, more adventures. Now, I'm not sure if Jesse will eventually meet Woody or Buzz, but that's a story for another day. What I do know is that Jesse's character will be definitely different. Compared to Toy Story 2 and 3, Jesse will feel a bit more loyal to her owner. And I guess she's very similar to Woody. Anyway guys, thanks for watching this theory. Let me know what you guys think. Comment down below, what do you think kind of toys do you think Jessica will get? I want to see what you guys think, but anyway, thanks for watching.